call upon the stage Arvind Bhamadi Bharti, Shri Kalpati, Ankit Nagabandi, Shivani Arvapalli, Vaishnavi Joshila, Arvind Govindaram, Arvind Tirumala, and Varun Kandarpa. Hello everyone. My name is Varun Kandarpa, a seventh grader at Academy of Aerospace and Engineering. What you see here are some of the pop groups year round events. I would now like to recap our 2016 annual event for you all. Last year, we had many amazing performances, the first of which was the Laya Vinyasa School of Dance. They came and performed a Kuchipudi dance. After them came CT Rhythms, who sung some melodious songs for everyone. It was a very interesting and fun experience. After that, er, then the Udon School of Dance performed a folk dance. Towards the end of the day, we had Dr. Prasad Srinivasan and Mrs. Kala Prasad come and give inspiring speeches. That day, we had almost 300 people in attendance. And we raised a record amount, creating a large impact towards our goal. We appreciate, we appreciate your support, and we hope it continues. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. My name is Vaishnavi Josila, and I'm an eighth grader currently attending Timothy Edwards Middle School. One of our main objectives is spreading awareness. We do this by setting up stalls in other community events. This year, we set up a snack stall at the Ogadi event on April 23rd, 2017, at the Delgo Association of Connecticut, also known as TAC. We sold several different snack items, such as samosa and chips, and raised about $470. By this, we were also able to explain to more than hundreds of people about our goals and accomplishments. Throughout this event, I learned how hard it is to earn each penny and how much effort has to be put in. I, I, I understand how difficult it is to give your hard-earned money away, and I would like to appreciate everyone here for supporting us. Once again, thank you all for all your support. My name is Arun Govandaram. I'm an 8th grader currently attending Annie Fisher Montessori Magnet School. Firstly, I would like to thank Millen and its organizers for gifting us the opportunity to set up a stall at their event. It was 90 degrees that day and we were all tired by the end. I really wondered how kids in India tolerate this heat every day of their lives. We spent almost 6 hours spreading awareness and were able to connect with a few gracious sponsors. We were also able to talk to people who were curious to know more about our group and our mission. Thank you. Hello everyone. My name is Shrikar Pati and I'm an 8th grader from East Grammy Middle School. Recently, I have attended Milan at Bushnell Park for fundraising for POP. Later that day, we were making sandwiches for the homeless and our group had distributed 80 sandwiches. There are over 4,000 homeless people in Connecticut alone, and that includes over 800 children, and we plan to help them. I've gotten so satisfaction that I was able to help people in need. Also, it was easy for me to communicate with others there due to participating in boot camp meetings. There, I have learned to think on my feet. You have to be ready for unexpected questions that you aren't prepared for. I was nervous and didn't know how to respond to some. In order to run events such as the chari charity dinner event, we participate in these boot camp meetings to improve our skills in confidence and communication. It was a fun and exciting experience that I had that day. I'm happy to be a part of this group. Together, one of our main goals is to eradicate hunger, and I'm confident as a group we all can achieve it. Thank you all for listening. Hello, my name is Arvind Babripati. I am an eighth grader going to Joseph A. DePaulo Middle School, which is here in Southington, Connecticut. Now I'm going to be talking about the Farmington High School football team, as well as volunteering at NSF. Kumar Darsh, Abhiram Babripati, my brother, and I went to go to the Farmington High School football game. Kumar's mom that day worked for three hours making cake pops, which we would then sell. We soon set up our stall and yelled out to everyone who walked by, cake pops for charity. This allowed us to tell people that all of this was going towards a good cause. It was a very successful day that day, for we were able to sell all 150 cake pops and raise over $200. 
Next, I'm going to be talking about volunteering at NSF. Our friends in Pop and I went to volunteer at NSF. For those of you who don't know what NSF is, it stands for North-South Foundation, where kids come to compete in various different subjects. So my friends in Pop Group and I went to volunteer there. We did things such as displaying posters, as well as displaying our own posters, and directing people to the right room so they know where they take their test. We were also able to tell many people about our group. Adult volunteers, along with our group leaders, were able to co correct o over 200 tests. It was a very successful day overall, and we were able to spread awareness to many people. Thank you. Hello everyone. I hope you are having a great time. I'm Arvind Thirmala, a 7th grader attending the Academy of Aerospace and Engineering. I'm here to talk to you about Foodshare. Foodshare is an organization who is trying to eradicate hunger, and that's one of our main goals. On July 5th, a group of us volunteered at Foodshare facility in Bluefield, Connecticut, and we helped pack about 6,300 pounds of bread in over 300 boxes, which were distributed to the needy. It was a great responsibility to do the job right, and it felt really satisfying at the end of the day. I was personally happy that I was part of this project, and it also made me realize that I should never waste food. There are so many people who are on this planet, in our country, in our state, and even in our own neighborhood who are food insecure. So please join me in taking an oath that we will never waste food so that people who don't have access to food will at least have a healthy meal. Thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Shivani Arvabali, and I am an eighth grader currently attending Timothy Edwards Middle School. Over the past couple of years, we have been volunteering in many different places all over Connecticut. This is the Simsbury Farm where we volunteered, where they assigned us different assignments related to barn work. Some of us washed tables, chairs, and school systems equipment, while others helped clean the stables. We volunteered for a total of three hours on August 16th at the community farm. We also made friends like Yodel and Echo the Goat plus Sadie the Bunny. The town farm is committed to promoting education and local agriculture in addition to feeding families in need. Personally, this made me understand how fortunate I am since I was struggling to work in that heat for three hours while there are millions of homeless children that are struggling in that heat much worse all day. These kids may not be achieving their basic facilities, which we have. Hopefully our experiences at these places have inspired many of you to keep helping our community. Thank you. Hello everyone, my name is Ankit Nagavandi. I am currently a ninth grader at Rock Hill High School. Every year we have community event during the summer to spread awareness about the pop group and our goals. This year we had hosted a talent show at the Second Arrives Roman Temple in Middletown, in Middletown, Connecticut. The kids had showed their talents by singing, dancing, and playing musical instruments. We also held an art competition so the kids could show off their artistic abilities. About 100 people showed up to the event, and we sold refreshments from which the money that we made would go towards our brand donation total. I felt, I felt that the event succeeded after my friend had wanted to join the pop group and make a difference in the community. I felt accomplished that I was able to encourage people to help out the orphan children at the Akhmavidya Ashram in Bangalore, India. Thank you and have a great evening. Over the past couple of years, the Power of Peace group has continued to inspire our community. We are fortunate that many kids and their parents approach us to become part of our team. This year, we added four new members who have shown great compassion and passion and have volunteered for over a year. I welcome them on behalf of the entire Power of Peace group. They are Aishani Nagamala, a sixth grader, Akhil Manisani, also a sixth grader, Jyotir Mai Madhulapalli, an eighth grader, and Shriya Bhatturi, a tenth grader. Please give them a warm round of applause. 